Hey guys, Donald Wombat here, and today I'm going to be introducing a brand new series that I'm going to be starting up on my channel. The series is going to be called Current Affairs Commentaries, and is basically going to be me discussing something big that is going on at the moment. It might be a major news story, something really funny that has happened in the world, maybe the latest stories from the gaming community, or even something that is really shocking. Basically, anything that is happening now and I feel is good enough to discuss with you guys. Now, this series is also aimed at being a very, a, a very interactive series. I'm really looking forward to reading comments in the comments section below and also possibly getting a bit of Twitter discussion going. Tweet me at Wombat Gaming if you have anything to say. The videos in the background of this series would just be a random game. They might be a decent Call of Duty game to some Nintendo stuff or maybe even some PC gaming. Without further ado, I will get into the first current affairs commentary. Now, if you live in Australia and you follow the news, even only a little bit, then I'm sure you would have heard of the story of two girls racially abuse, abusing and assaulting an elderly Aboriginal man on a Queensland bus. The story goes that the two teenage girls had been to the local races and were drunk and obnoxious on the bus. The elderly man, who was 77 and blind, asked the girls to leave the bus, and this sparked them to racially abuse and assault him, as well as abusing many other people on the bus. In the video which surfaced online, you can hear them making racist remarks as well as see, him see them punching and kicking the man who tries to resist by fighting back and pushing the girls but is no match for them. The attack is finally stopped when another man from the bus gets between the girls and the elderly man and pushes the girls off the bus. In the aftermath, the elderly man is left bruised and in tears. Today, police tracked him down and it is believed that he will make an official complaint and that hopefully the girls will be charged with assault and maybe even some more serious charges. The video is really quite difficult to sit through and watch. Most of us have grandparents or know of some elderly people that are in that sort of age range of 77. And to me, the personally, the thought of someone intently attacking someone at this age who is almost completely blind is quite disgusting. The fact that they were girls makes the video even more shocking. Now, as an Australian, I think it is quite well known that we as a nation don't have the best record when it comes to racism. And a lot of other countries, just on face value, see us as a very racist nation. Now, I personally disagree with this statement, but it is stupid little incidents like this from a very small minority of the population that keep this image of our country fresh in the minds of others. For me, I really hope that the police try and make an example out of these girls and punish them quite severely. Their behaviour was just a disgrace to themselves and Australia as a country, and it is things like this that can put our country back years when it comes to race relations. The fact that this attack was extremely public and offensive and took place on a packed bus makes the attack even more disgraceful. I think it would be a shame and would upset a lot of people if these girls got away with just a slap on the wrist. If you haven't already seen the video, I will put a link for you in the description below as well as the news article accompanying it. What are your thoughts on the attack? Leave me a comment below or tweet me at Wombat Gaming. Subscribe for more regular videos and leave a like if you've enjoyed this one. I've been Wombat, catch you later.